you first, that make it exclusive. It's for members only, you're probably not included. First watch finest, I only hang with shooters. If I pop out with this cannon, then we gon' make a new year. I come through a gang on them and bang on them. Hanging out the window and put that flame on them. Anybody get these bullets, ain't got names on them. Would you like to subscribe, then hit the play button. Yeah. That's gonna settle shit, but and I don't mean like deeper, like it's gonna be more violent than that. I'm not implying anything like that. But the type of shit this fool's on, like, bro. Bro. You got me so fucking twisted. You got me so fucking twisted. No, I, it ain't even about the GPS community. I ain't even mad. Like, I got love for everybody. You feel me? Like my like my boy. Smack say I come in peace. But I don't fuck with catfishes. And people on some trying to get on their Mante Tao shit. Old Indian people. That's scandalous. That shit's scandalous. No, this is not the car I took a shit in. That's my boy Digit's car. Hey, it's all good. I appreciate that. I, and I'm trying to be mature here. I really am. And um, obviously, I'm staying clean and sober through all this. It's not that serious. I've endured a lot more than this. And I'm not going to crash out and affect my job or anything. But, like, bruh. Like, here's the thing. Here's the thing. I thought that we were just on some podcasting shit. I thought we were just roasting. Yeah, it's four digits. Is a car I'm renting full? What the fuck? What do you want to see my pink slip? Show me your car and I'll show you my pink slip. If you want to talk that shit, dumbass hoe. This ain't even that serious. This is a regular fucking Lexus SUV. I've had way crazier whips than this. Who the fuck do you... These motherfucking new booty-ass fans don't know who the fuck I am. It's all good. I know a lot of y'all been down for a minute. This ain't shit. Look, let me tell you something, all right? What's up, Kristen? Let me tell you something, all right? Oh, shit. I'm about to hit a damn puddle. Scott! Um, I thought we was just podcasting and, like, roasting... And I'm literally, like, doing my job and doing what the person who employs me is telling me to do. And I thought it was all fun and games. Did it go a bit too far? Yes. Were there things that I did wrong in the situation? Absolutely. I was nowhere in near in the mind frame of there being anything more from that situation than just us, than just us, um, podcasting and talking about shit and creating content. I thought it was funny. I thought it was all funny games. All of a sudden, the same dude that literally has built his entire career on talking shit to people, on on trying to embarrass people, on trying to expose people, on talking down to them, doing all kinds of extra shit on a literally like collegiate autistic level. You feel me? The most neurodivergent skill set I've ever witnessed when it comes to trying to dissect people in my entire life. All of a sudden is in his feelings when the tables have turned. And that's why Adam was saying yesterday, like the fact that there's this narrative of him being bullied when this is literally the same shit he's done himself for motherfucking years, even before he was a part of this community to the point where he's threatening to fucking hurt six-year-old girls and had lawsuits over it and all this kind of shit. You feel me? Like, whatever the fuck it was, told told women, like, yo, you, you need to dig your dead daughter's grave up and, like, all kinds of shit. All of a sudden, all of a sudden, like, his feelings are hurt and he's crying on the phone to AD and then he wants to fucking fight? Like, it's now a physical thing? I didn't go to work on that shit. I'm fucking 41 years old. I haven't been like, yo, like, I'm from somewhere, but I'm not fucking active. 
I fucking hung my jersey up a long ass time ago. Are you fucking kidding? Like, I still got respect where I'm from, but it's not even like that. Then this, and and I've literally, I've been sober for three years. I haven't had the need. I haven't barely gotten into any type of thing beyond a physical, like that would warrant a physical altercation, much less that. And I'm at work where one of my homies slash colleagues literally just got suspended for a few weeks because of a physical altercation. This fool calls me out, which fucking took me off, caught me off guard. I didn't even think he was serious, but I understand the optics of it all. It looks fucking crazy. And I was really trying to be mature about, mature about this. And I was even willing to eat the people being like, oh, he turned it down. When I didn't, I got my shit, took my shit off, walked in the other room, ready to get down. Then other people are like, then, and we both was ready to get down. He fucking turned, uh, we had the motherfucking security guard squash the shit. So it's like, it's not finna even happen or whatever. Then I'm like, all right, for sure. Then this fool wants to go and talk about how I turned it down and twist the entire entire narrative of it. He literally has a discord full of people. He's claiming it's not true. And he's claiming he doesn't want drama in 23. This motherfucker has an entire, A. Hey, your dad's 49 and we're violating me. Don't underestimate old man strength. I'd be more scared of your dad than I would you. You feel me? Um, and literally, like, this motherfucker has an entire Discord full of people doing a digital attack on me for, like, combining forces with the people that already didn't fuck with me to try to make me look some type of way. And it's like, and I'm supposed to just sit back and take it after the fact? Like, come on, bro. So, off top, I need that. Ain't nothing going down at the workplace, but I need that. And beyond that, we need to rectify this situation. And, like, I'm not going to jeopardize my job. But other than that, it is what it is. And I'm really fucking from here. And you, I really don't want it to get uglier than it already is. But, you know, a fade's going to be a fade. Even if he fucking beat my ass, he weighs fucking 600 pounds. He looks like a fucking warthog. Like, regardless, regardless, it is what it is. Like, something else, like, this, what he's done as a result, after the fact, it needs to be addressed, and he needs to clear that shit up. In fact, we wouldn't even need to get down if he would just tell the truth about what happened and fix the situation. We wouldn't even need to get down, but... Yeah, I don't, isn't it crazy that a catfish account is so invested in me right now? Like a catfish account. You know that's not really a bitch. 